Like more cowbell proudly presents an evening of improv and song. These songs have never been heard. We don't know any of the words. We make it up as we go along. So if you'll help us to begin, trust me, the answer won't question. We'll make a scene out of any old thing. Would you give us a suggestion?
Is there a button or something? I've just been swiping. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm still married. I'm just trying to help. What? I'm just trying to help. I don't okay. want you to feel alone. No. First of all, that's amazing. Thank you for your support. You've always been there for me. Yeah. Do you want your wife find out? Okay, no. Okay. Where's the filter where you get the hat? Like that's the hat? Snapchat. Oh. <laughs> that's a different one. <laughs> I'll be damned. I'm on the wrong thing. Damn it, Albert. You were swiping on Snapchat? I thought I was. I just saw people's pictures. I thought I was looking at people's pictures. Oh, damn it. You probably have like 14 Russian girlfriends right now. <laughs> I've made a lot of messages. <laughs> but this is. No, this isn't about. What I'm do I say? You. What do I say? Say, I'm fun. And that, that's enough. I mean, that's what they like, right? Girls like fun. I'm fine. I am fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. How much do you make a year? And what do you, what are your hobbies? Um, I, don't, I haven't been single in 12 years, so. Oh, damn. I'm just, I'm just trying to be here for you, Hold on. man. Ha ha. Winky face. It's in the middle of the dog. Oh, hold on. Back, 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 back. Quote, dog days. Quote, isn't it? Question mark. Two hearts and dollar signs flying away. What the hell did you just say? I don't know! <laughs> oh my god, I think he thinks I'm a dog. Wait. It's got a heart, but he likes dogs. He put hearts on. It's been 12 years since I've been on Tinder. It's too, too quiet. It's too quiet. I think that's code. I think it's code. I screwed up. It's what about the ha ha means he's fun. No, the ha ha is laughing at me because it's in a bikini picture. I knew I had fun or five. Look, you've been married a long time. You're self conscious about your appearance. You're still on Snapchat. What are you doing? Stop putting filters out. Alright, I'm gonna send a message back. You should. Um, um, you've got a nice smile, I should know. Hashtag dental health. <laughs> he knows we're cool. It shows that you're confident in what you do. Yeah. Oh shit! I dropped it. She responded back. <laughs> She said I had a nice smile. That's a good thing. Maybe we can hang out for a while. That's also a good thing. <laughs> Teeth, but she's really different yet, so it's okay. Don't ever tell her. Gotta find some teeth really quick <laughs> before she finds out. I'm so proud of you getting out there again. After all that happened last time, don't mention last time again. I'm trying not to, but it's quite the story. The whole town knows that sad story. <laughs> we do. Uh, what? This is a popular bus stop. Everybody's here to see you. Root you on. Go get them, tiger. Stop putting pressure on. Get them, tiger. Look at you. You're a tiger. That's still snap. Be there.
best clapper today. It's only Tuesday. I don't want to scare her away. I've got to find a way to pay for drinks and dinner and Uber. Movie tickets, the popcorn and super. I don't know where to go to Tinseltown or Sunray.
Damn it, stop! The stink! I told you, Kev, baby and him, he wasn't going to escape the team. Now we act like an asshole. <laughs> oh, God. Don't listen to your father, honey. He's got dementia. <laughs> no, he doesn't have dementia. He's... Well, we pretend like he does because he says... No, so I don't. Land. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> what? 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 You... See, he has no moms. Offlandish is a word also. I <laughs> Honey, listen. Can you li just just sit here with me for just shh? I, I didn't say I didn't shh. moms. Oh, no, I, I didn't know you weren't speaking. I know that. Gave birth to a boy and now he's a woman. Transgender. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. I still have my penis. I'm not. It's not going at home. We all know you've got your penis, honey. Mom, don't, don't say we that. We know you got a penis. Don't say the penis. No, it's not wrong. I Mom, know you're a real bitch right now. <laughs> Gilbert, please. Okay, listen. Just everyone be quiet for one second, please. Just open your ears and listen. Yeah, hold on. Let me Guys, go. Gilbert, God damn it. I'll shut up while you Gilbert, <laughs> Gilbert, give me a second. Change his diaper. I'm not, no! Listen, these are boxer briefs, they're not diapers! <laughs> Listen, they bunch up in the real men wear boxers. Well, stop rubbing paper and rubbing my shirt! Stop it! Don't be mad, I'm wearing diapers right now. You already saw that! <laughs> See, you'll be like your father one day. That's something to aspire to. What? What? <laughs> no, he's wearing diapers right now! He's got dementia! No, he, he doesn't have dementia, he's just drunk! Oh, There's just a just difference! Listen, honey, just listen. <laughs> Bless you. You'll be surprised what you hear. But he didn't sneeze. That's it's not. I, oh, I am on. aware of what's going on around me. <laughs> I'm acutely aware. I am a woman. <laughs> yes. I know these things. You know what? It's for... Open your ears. I, they're, they're, oh God. You'll be surprised. Jesus in heaven. You'll be surprised what you oh, hear, honey. I'm, the, all I hear is you. Who's oh. a strong little boy? I'm a strong little boy. I'm not a baby or little. I'm 36. Thirty-six, thirty schmicks. <laughs> what? You heard what I said. <laughs> Mom, listen up. I fucked up today in a really big way. I tried to work really hard. I tried to get a great job, but then instead I get this guy that you guys think is a slob. What can I do to make you proud? What can I do to be successful? All I want to do is ride into the beautiful sunset of Silicon Valley. I want you to love me. <laughs> You'll never be a digital designer. Silicon Breast? What? No, 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 no Dad. I, it's, are you? Listen, listen. I gotta tell you something. I feel like you're losing touch of where you're from. So let's. Well. Let me tell you a story. Why are you keep putting paper right on the chest? When you were just a baby <laughs> and you were sent to us through my body, through my body. Wait, what? 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 <laughs> you were literally sent to us. I don't want you to think that we adopted you. I just yeah, you're there. Like a gift from God. Let me keep going. <laughs> like a gift from God, we work so hard to give you opportunities to thrive. I know what you're thinking. Why be alive? <laughs> no, I wasn't thinking that at all. Suicide <laughs> should never be enough. No, stop rubbing me. <laughs> Baby, you said you wanted to go into the bright lights. The bright lights of Silicon Valley. That's a, it's like a suicide thing, right? <laughs> no, mom, it isn't. Oh, there's literally bright lights in Silicon Valley. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. Look, Mom and Dad, you really don't have a clue about the world out there. It's such a zoo. You have to fight tooth and nail for every step. For big meetings, you've got to prep. But I screwed up. I screwed up royally. Okay, so 
happened to him, Gilbert? Look at him. He's got a cold. Sorry. You're not mine. <laughs> not mine. You're going to my room. I didn't know what to say though, because I was I was working, you know, and yeah. he was like, "What do you like?" And I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm in my Captain Eats uniform, and I was like, "Shrimp." Uh -huh. I don't know what else to tell him. Well, you know, shrimp are sexy. Yeah, they are kind of because they got like a tail and yeah, yeah they're sort yeah. Do you, you know how long one bite with a tail on it? Yeah, yeah, you can put the whole thing in, that's, yeah. Guys like that. Guys really like that. Yeah, they do, they do. Yeah. They do. Like, you think, you think, like, it's been three days, though. It's been three days since he talked to you? Yeah, uh, like, he kind of came up, and he, I was like, hi, man, take your order, and we, like, had a conversation, and then he said, I'm going to call you, and, uh. Oh, having a conversation over the counter at work is really like a date. Yeah. Yeah. So it was like your first date. Yeah, it kind of was. Like, but what did I say wrong? I don't know. Did I even give him a number? Three days. I'm sure you did. But three days after your first date is a long time to wait. Yeah, that's a long time. It's a long time. It's a really long time. It's a long time. I'd be worried if I were you. You should worry. I am so. I'm so worried. You should really I be almost worried. cussed. You almost cussed. I'm... You should get the door. Can we get the door? I'll get the door. You look nervous. I'll get the door. I'm scared to death. I didn't give an address. Hi. Hi. Is Sheila here? Sheila's here. Sheila's here. Please come in. Welcome. <coughs> Welcome to our apartment. Sheila's here. Sheila, there's somebody here for you. Hello, Gerald. Hello, Sheila. Hi, Gerald. Good to see you. What's flowers? Oh. Yeah. For, so for Sheila. Those are. Pretty lilacs. I'll, I'll give you can't touch them. Sorry. I'm allergic anyway. I knew that. You saved my life just then. I know. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll put them in water so you don't have to get hives. Okay, good. I had to demonstrate to you that I knew more about you than you knew about yourself. Also, I waited three days because that's how long the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ waited before He revealed Himself to all people as a Savior of mankind. You saw my li <laughs> you saw my LinkedIn quote. I also saw your your crucifix you had stitched onto your underclothing. Your mother is, is wonderful. She's a saint. She's a saint. You saw Sheila's underclothing? Well, sort well, it was a, she was on the wrong side as Captain D's uniform, like she is now. Everything is visible. It's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I, I'm just like, really impressed that Gerald was noticing absolutely so many things about you. Yeah, I have a lot of online profiles. <laughs> I'm just saying, that's not creepy at all. That's, that's like paying attention. Part, there's a part of me, like the duality of man, there's a part of me that's terrified of what is happening right now. There's a part of me that is so impressed. Mrs. Robinson, may I step closer to your daughter? You, you can take three steps closer to my daughter. Oh, Gerald. Right Jesus, play right for Jesus. Gerald, you're so much closer than you were before. <laughs> I've never been further away from you. Well, metaphorically speaking. And, well, not literally, because, no. Okay. I should have had more profiles set in private, but if I had done that, you wouldn't have made it here to our loft. The only private I want to have with you is yours. Do you really like shrimp, or did you lie to me? Get out of the way! No, literally, get out of the way. Oh! Look at you with one bite. The tail tip. <laughs> They're not fully cooked yet, I just put them in. But I still am in love with what just happened. Sheila, this is really, really important because when a man goes out and does a task to prove that he likes you, that's a serious thing. And he took those shrimp seriously and he performed the task of shrubbing, shoving those shrimp down his gullet to prove to you that he really likes shrimp. That's like the equivalent of Jason and the Argonauts in the real world. Yeah. yeah. Mrs. Robinson, will you please stop talking for one second? <laughs> you put your hand in lukewarm, not yet boiled water. Will you please shut up, okay. Sheila? I was trying to be your wingman. 
<laughs> oh shit. Oh. This is so. This is so. series of steps towards a direction. Sometimes you get a fast pass and you ride a lot sooner. That's a metaphor for what's happening. This is my fast Just